So this app can start the web camera and displays the video stream to the page. Then we can capture a snapshot from the video stream and then put it to a canvas. We can then right-click the image and save it as JPEG. We also have an image URL conversion. So let's take a look at the code. So here is the HTML markup. As you can see, we have two buttons, a video element, a div container, a text area element and a canvas element. We will reference these elements in our JavaScript. So here is our JavaScript code. As you can see, we have declared six variables to reference elements. The first one gets the start camera button, the second variable gets the video element, the third one gets a reference to the take snapshot button, the fourth variable is the canvas, the fifth variable get the text area element and the last variable references the div container for the data URL. Then we add an event listener to start the web camera. The next event listener get the snapshot from the video element and place it to the canvas element. Then it converts the image into a data URL and place it to the text area. So now, let's take a look at the CSS styles. It's just a simple style to arrange the elements, you can add more styling depending on your preference. So that's how you can capture a photo or a snapshot from web camera using JavaScript. Until next time. Bye.